Good morning. Good morning. Ohayou gozaimasu in Japanese. Uh, it is a great pleasure to attend uh, this very important Japan Caribbean Climate Change Partnership project launch here in Jamaica. As Ambassador of Japan to Jamaica, I am pleased to note first and foremost that our Japan CARICOM partnership is being uh, strengthened on a much larger scale, including high level visits of our Prime Ministers and respective ministers right here in the Caribbean region. As you may know, uh, Prime Minister uh, Abe attended the first Japan CARICOM summit meeting, which was held in Trinidad and Tobago in July 2014. He announced there Japan's policy toward the CARICOM consisting of following three pillars. First pillar, cooperation towards sustainable development, including overcoming vulnerabilities particular to small island states. Second pillar, deepening and expanding bonds founded on exchanges and friendship. Third pillar, cooperation in addressing challenges of the international community. Again, in September uh, 2015, last year, Prime Minister Abe also visited Jamaica as the first Japanese Prime Minister to make a visit to this uh, beautiful country since the establishment of diplomatic relationship between Japan and Jamaica. In this visit, Prime Minister Abe reaffirmed Japan's commitment to continue working with CARICOM member countries towards the achievement of the objectives outlined under the three pillar policy. The Japan Caribbean Climate Change Partners Project represents our efforts to substantiate our cooperation towards sustainable development in the area of climate change under the first pillar of our policy towards CARICOM. The exchange of notes of this project was signed during the Japan CARICOM Summit held in Trinidad and Tobago in the presence of participating heads of CARICOM member states and Prime Minister Abe. Uh, 